It was just a few weeks ago when these windows to the Amazon office were shattered. Milo Yiannopoulos' speech shut down by protesters. At the end of the month, the Berkeley College Republicans planning to invite conservative and some may describe her as controversial right-wing speaker and culture, calling it a second test on whether or not Berkeley truly is the home of the free speech movement. In a radio interview, Coulter Seth she'll touch on immigration. BCR Executive Vice President Brandon West says that the speech will cover exactly that and a range of topics on April 27. The location of the speech has not been announced. Well, we're taking extensive steps with UCPD and we're confident that it'll be a very safe, very professional event and protesters won't be able to shut it down like they did at Milo. And if they do, it'll reflect very badly on this, this campus's law enforcement and on this administration, extremely badly, extremely badly. Undergraduate student Elena Torres hopes that if members of the campus community protest culture's visit, that the value of a peaceful protest would not be diminished due to a number of violent members. I think that if we do want to protest and we do want to express our beliefs and our concerns over what kind of people are coming to Berkeley, I think we should do it in a peaceful way just to help out the movement overall and to get the point across in a more positive light. Local media reports that the Young America's Foundation will pay for the majority of Coulter's $20,000 speaking fee. The university in a statement saying that this type of invitation in no way is an endorsement of any particular point of view. Reporting for Cal TV News, I'm Thomas Manglonia.